New this hour, one person is dead after a crash in Westlaco. Police tell us the driver of an SUV crashed into the property of a home. Channel 5's Lauren Kendrick is tracking the story. She joins us live in the studio with more. Lauren. Yeah, Steve, Sergeant Bernie Garza with Westlaco PD tells us they got the call around 8 o'clock this morning. The driver of a Jeep Cherokee, 20 year old Renee Garcia, lost control of the vehicle, crashing into multiple vehicles on the property. Take a look at video from the scene. Now we're told the front passenger, 18 year old Zahit Perez, was taken to a hospital but has been released. 19 year old Juan Espinosa, the rear passenger, died at the scene. This happened in the 1800 block of Bridge Avenue. No one inside the home was injured. One of the vehicles at the home that was hit crashed into the front of the home. Richard Hinojosa was asleep inside with his wife when the crash happened. If it wasn't for my car being here, he would have slammed into our house. Uh, and chances are, I don't know, some really, something pretty bad could have happened to me and my wife because we sleep in that room right there. Hinojosa tells us this isn't the first time someone has crashed into his property. This is the third time in two years. And you'll hear more from him coming up tonight at 10 and what he hopes is done to prevent another incident like this from happening. Wesco police tell us no arrests have been made yet. Reporting in the studio, Lauren Kendrick, Channel 5 News, this weekend.